Hello everyone, welcome to Admitat Academy. That's me again, Yekaterina Vasina, the head of video content at the Admitat Academy. And today we are going to review Admitat terms for publishers and how we should comply with them. So to begin with the first imported document with rules we find when we insert our personal data in the registration form. Right here you can see it on the screen. Here you can see the hyperlink terms for publishers. If you want to see the full text of rules you should click on it. And now we can see the full text of terms for publishers. Here you can read it through and see the general provisions, the subject of the agreement, the rights and liabilities of publishers, and so on and so forth. Here you can see the list of things that publishers can do and what's forbidden in the affiliate network Admitad. We strongly recommend you to read through this document before joining an affiliate network because if you break any rules, you can be disconnected from working with Admitad and from working with Admitad advertisers. And what's even more, some publishers can be fined for some really serious violations. And also you can see here, while registering for Admitad, another document, Privacy Policy. You can click on it and read how Admitad collects and stores your personal data. But these are not the only rules which publishers should know and comply with. All advertisers indicate uh, the terms and conditions of working with their affiliate programs in the program review and all publishers should read them uh, before joining this affiliate program. Okay, so let's check where we can find these rules. First of all, we need to log in to our personal account. Here we need to type in our login and our password. Now we need to open uh, the affiliate program of any advertiser. For that, we open the section All Programs. Okay, so now here we can see in the catalog of programs all affiliate programs which we have in Admitad. Let's open any affiliate program, for example, iHerb. And here we can see the program review. Sometimes advertisers also indicate some rules in the program review. For example, here we can see that paid search traffic is prohibited. But all the rules we can find in the menu on the left. Here you can see the tab rules. Let's open basics. And here all the advertisers indicate what publishers are allowed to do and what's forbidden. Sometimes also advertisers uh, list here the reasons for publishers disconnecting. So before joining this affiliate program or any affiliate program, we strongly recommend you to examine these rules and to be sure that you can comply with them. The next tab is traffic sources. It's also very important. Here you can see that some traffic channels are forbidden, that some are allowed and also that some needs approval. I think it's really clear when advertiser shows that uh, the traffic source is allowed or forbidden, but what does it mean that the traffic source needs approval? It means that, for example, in this case, it's email marketing, that before sending the email newsletters, all publishers should approve, for example, text and templates with the advertiser. So how can you do it? There are two ways. Uh, first of all, you can uh, approve it uh, with the help of your personal manager, or if you don't have the personal manager, you can do it with the help of support. Here you can create a ticket and uh, ask uh, to approve uh, your email newsletter. Okay, so that's it. Before joining any program, we strongly recommend you to make sure that your traffic source is allowed by the advertiser. And if your traffic channel isn't allowed, we recommend you to choose another advertiser to work with, or if you really want to work with this brand and to promote the products of this brand, we recommend you to try any other traffic channel. Maybe you will succeed using it. So that's all regarding the traffic sources, the rules and terms for publishers. We strongly advise you against breaking 
breaking any rules because the system will detect all the violations anyway and all dishonest publishers will be disconnected and some of them even can be fined. It happens simply because no company, no brand wants to work with dishonest partners. But if you're going to promote uh, the products of brands honestly, your work with Admitat and with Admitat advertisers will be long and successful. And that's it for now. Thank you for your attention. As you know, you can leave all your questions in the comments and we will answer them later. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and to like our video and see you in the next one. See you. Bye-bye.